What's going on, David Dreamers? <laughs> Hello, Dreamglow Dreamers. <laughs> Finally, the big podcast in the sky is returning to the channel. Yippee! After a long hiatus. Mm-hmm. Over long. Um, well, why don't we just start off a discussion? Uh, yeah. Hoopa. <laughs> Hoopa. Has recently been released for Showdown play. Yep. Um, the long-awaited Legendary has mm-hmm. come to play once again. Yeah. Once again, that doesn't make sense. But <laughs> back again, once again. Basically, I don't like it. Yeah, I don't like the it. The consensus either. is it's cool. It's gonna go down to like you. It, like, my yeah. thoughts are, yeah, someone will Hoopa. figure out a good set that'll be broken. Someone will break it because it it, can, it looks like it'll break at any second. You know what I mean? Yeah, like Unbound is definitely like good. We just yeah, haven't like figured out a way to use it yet. Basic attack, 170 yeah, base like, special attack. It's yeah. gonna be good. And like a 130 special defense is not too yeah, bad. It doesn't either. even hurt. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't hurt at all. Uh, but it's an HP, great move pool. It's just so weak physically. That's really kind of a drawback. Yeah, especially with the hyperspace fury dropping your own defense. Yeah, it's typing being less than savory with a bunch of yeah, quad and weaknesses. I just realized that's a weak physically. I mean defensively. Yeah. That's, I, yeah, I yeah. don't know if I made that yeah. clear. Defense stat yeah. physically weak. It's just like it just dies to so much. Mm-hmm. So the shit you're, you're like, ah, oh, this thing's a monster. It can take this, and then it's like and dead. It doesn't and you're like, like oh, there's a bullet punch from a bandit steelix. Bandit steelix, <laughs> yes. Yeah, you just get ever bullet so punch. common. Like, yeah, like, <laughs> hashtag bullet punch for steelix. It's like half of your letters when you're doing a tweet. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if there's a ratio there. You know, like the I best really? thing if there's like a trend among the trends. Like in the last, didn't, that gave them enough room to talk. In the last ten seconds, I just drew on myself like three times with this pen. You're a champion. You know you can close that, that pen. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's the problem. It's a closable pen. Yeah, it's quick. <laughs> that's funny. Um, yeah, Hoopa though. It's Regular bad. Hoopa, definitely gonna drop. I think. Just Down having that the ghost and dark weakness. Yeah. In this like the four times weakness, I should say. Yeah. In this meta is just really rough. And there's like, t- there's like strong legendaries in UU, there's some strong yeah, legendaries definitely. there, like Kiram, uh, mm-hmm. is Kiram, and like, fuck Kiram, by the way. Um, <laughs> yeah. And like, Victini was there for a while. Is it gone? <laughs> I never wanted no, Yeah, Victini is gone, Victini is gone, yeah. Okay. The Victini days um, just made me so sad. <laughs> yeah, I remember 5th gen playing, just like, wasn't it like Shadow Tag Chandelier was a thing? In oh like god, I, that went away fast. I know yeah. that went away fast, real fast. <laughs> but Chandler just was like, it yeah, it was Chandler, Victini, and Heracross, and Darmanitan. And Darmanitan. And those were the three things. And if someone ran all three of those, your fire was just was not going to be able to take all of them. No. And like that's just a stupid thing to run all three of them. Yeah, really South Rocks. But like you know what I mean. Like, <laughs> yeah, theoretically, you could have just overpowered them with fire yeah, attack. And like scarfed every single one of them. Yeah, yeah. Oh, exactly. <laughs> all three of them were in yeah. scarf pretty much all the time. That's what UU was, was the land of the scars. Yeah. But yeah, I think Hoopa will, I think regular Hoopa might find a comfortable kind of place in UU. Yeah, I think it will. I think it's got great potential as a bulky special attacker. Yeah. I've um, been thinking of like a sub nasty platter and sub Does it get trick room? It does. That would be a good trick room. Suddenly. Thing. Uh, but suddenly, yeah. I'm about to make a <laughs> It's just the weakness to priority. That's the yeah. problem. Big problem with that sucker punch. It does not like sucker punch yeah, at sucker all. Punch so don't run so assault vest. Could get up a sub. Yeah, sub sub uh, could be functional. Uh, but it's, yeah, sucker punch and shadow sneak. That sub nasty are both that you put up. Things. That's cool. Yeah. Conceptually, I always automatically set my teams to argue <laughs> the format. You yeah. Know, they don't mean to. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like are you like it's just the best. Are you the fucking most coolest? Team I've been I've been thinking about trying to end you lately though. I really? haven't played any in a long I time. Like, and it looks I don't know fun. why that I don't like it because I I, I <laughs> love a lot, a lot of, of Pokemon. You, Pokemon yeah. and are you? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but that's like what I enjoy about using yeah, it is, yeah. is that are you is actually something people play and like and you no offense to and you players <laughs> and there is like a decent number of you. Yeah. Like, actually, I've been looking at like. The, if you look at like a list of all the rooms and stuff, mm-hmm. like, usually NU is above RU. Really? Yeah. Well, I think those people talk among themselves more often. Oh, yeah. yeah, it is. Like NU, like, there's a lot more people that are like, I'm going to play serious low tier, so I'm going to go all the way down to NU instead okay. of skip over RU. RU is kind of the lazy man's NU, to be honest. Yeah. You still want to use some powerful stuff that just doesn't mm-hmm. get used very often. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> like Flygon. 
Flygon, <laughs> like, what are you doing down there? Jolteon, like, get lost. Like, no offense, <laughs> I love Jolteon, I love running it, but how did it even get yeah, here? Right. Like, there's a pure oversight that it landed here. Yeah, like, I like it. You probably could go back to UU because, like, there's not, like, any fast electric types as much in yeah, UU anymore. Yeah, well, Heliolisk like, right is Coon. chilling right oh, yeah, there, Heliolisk, isn't he? Yeah, Heliolisk. He took over, basically, which yeah, is weird because, I don't know, I just don't feel like it's got the same. It's got yeah, dual stab, which really, really makes, music, it, yeah, dual makes stab a big difference. It's the one thing it has, like, over all the other fast electric types. Yeah. But like Jolteon's got that 130 base speed. That's such uh, fresh speed. Yeah, I love yeah, Pokemon so with 130 base speed because you don't have to worry about. That's like the, one of the biggest problems I think in in the game is being mm -hmm. slower than someone else and getting hit before them. I mean, it's as yeah, simple as that. Like speed is like it's very very important to consider and like all the time. And I forget about it so much. Oh, dude, this could be like the ultimate trick room setter. You know what I mean? You can run Destiny Mon. Yeah. <laughs> to like this trick room Destiny. Like mod. trick room and then get out and then like have to. Like camera up to come in or something. <laughs> <laughs> like in camera, yeah. so strong. So maybe Trick Room Hooper will be the set to run. We'll I'm already thinking, like, man, it could yeah. be powerful with Life Orb Trick Room. Like, yeah, so think, strong. Although it's I think like I might just have to wait so for Hoopa to drop to UU before I really use it. Because, like, it's still in OU now. And it's yeah. like, if you're going to use Hoopa in OU, you might as well use Unbound. Yeah, you might as well use Unbound. That's exactly what I thought. And, you know, it's, it's kind of funny because when you see it in Team Preview, it does look the same regardless yeah. until it comes out, which is which is neat because it's mm -hmm. like. It's like, which one do they? Which one is it? Like, but I guess, like, the real Team Preview at the beginning, you get to see what's going on. Do you? Oh, you do. Yeah. yeah. That's true. Yeah, <laughs> it's like a whole team out there. It doesn't really work in the end. Mm. But, um, yeah, I think it's typing is just bad, and it's basically what it comes down to. It's typing is cool, unique, yeah. powerful, stab. But, like, yeah, it's just like those terrible weaknesses. Just horrid weaknesses. Yeah. Quad weaknesses is mm. never really good to have. Yeah, and it gets a little better with Unbound, but not quite. Because mm -hmm. it still has that four time bug weakness, like Malamar. Malamar, you poor bastard. Yeah. Malamar is such a around. cool Pokemon. But it really is. I would love to use Topsy Turvy. It's like such an <laughs> awesome concept. Like s just wreck sweepers. Wreck like sweepers. something with prankster Topsy, -topsy Turvy oh. would be the end of oh. sweeping. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. <laughs> would be the end of setup like, sweeping altogether. Like, would be so done. You're like, mm, nah, now you suck. And <laughs> <laughs> you were great, and now you're now horrible. You're like, go ahead, Sigilyph, mm. do your thing. Oh, oh. you're. At negative all. Okay. <laughs> negative all. I'm pretty sure stored power actually doesn't care if it's a subtraction uh, or, or no. That's it. Just doesn't count. It doesn't okay. count negatively doesn't count though. Negative. It's like it's yeah. not like he'd be like you don't get like healing you <laughs> 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 with his horrible like yeah. minus four minus four minus six <laughs> minus six. Really. Anyway, we're kind of getting into the subject a little bit now. Yeah. So why don't we move up to seventh gen speculation? Okay. Okay. Uh, we're just not really like talking about like what's being leaked or like. What yeah, there isn't really game anything game. Going to go on yeah. other than um, the new pictures of Zygarde's new form. Mm. But like, and that little weird thing yeah, that people were claiming we saw ghost in the looking thing. Yeah, uh, it looks like a ghost rock type to me. I would love to see that, but like, I just feel like since they're sketches, um, yeah, that second yeah. sketch looked really cool. But like, was that person? I don't know if that person yeah. was present. I thought there was a little more to go off of, but it yeah. just seems like it's a person that saw something and is telling us about yeah, it. Yeah, so this could just as easily be, you know. Any of a million. Like, are there a yeah. lot of people confirming that they saw it too? Like, I don't know. I didn't yeah, see that. I don't know enough. Yeah. But, but that's why we're going to focus on uh, something that we think is more, a little more interesting, which yeah, is that quote what from kind of improvements we want to see. Yeah, there was a guy who said, uh, I don't remember who it was, but it, it wasn't Iwata himself, I don't think. But it was Ken Sugiori or whatever the fuck. Ken Sugimori, yeah. Sugimori, yeah. Um, uh, he was saying that. You know, they want to go back to the basics a little. They don't want to make anything like more complicated. Like they add mm. fairy type. That's a huge complex. That's like that's yeah. brand new. That the new type hasn't come out since second gen. You know. Yeah. Everyone knows that. Um, <laughs> but that's that's major. You know, that's a major change. And they really shook the meta up a lot. Like Clefable was not. Yeah, Clefable. Good. No one ever heard of Clefable. <laughs> no one even heard of Clefable or Gardevoir <laughs> before this happened. Like this was major. Um, and they want to go back to simplicity. So what I think mm -hmm. simplicity could very easily mean, and what I think the series has been overdue for for a long time, is a stat overhaul. Just to yeah, be like, look, Pokemon, that like, why the fuck is Tauros so not good? Like, Tor like a, it's like a strong motherfucking Pokemon. Like, it should be able yeah. to take on bigger threats. It should be a, a higher tier. I know a lot of things are limited by their type, mm -hmm. but like... 
what I think, I said this earlier, and I'm eating Cheerios now, which is unprofessional, but <laughs> what I was thinking earlier is what they need to take into account when they do the stats is not just their, the Pokemon's appearance in the story. Like, as, as you, like, that's obviously a major thing that we don't think about a lot in the com- competitive community, but, like, how early, we were talking about this before, Ariados and its base stat total being, like, 295 or something like that. 390. 390. What, really? Yeah. I thought it was 290, but okay. Whatever, <laughs> that's crazy. Um, <laughs> everyone run Ariados. Sticky web for life. Um, Ariados's, like, stats are good because you, for the level you can get it at, but then yeah. it gets outpaced fairly quickly. It's like the whole thing with bug Pokemon. That's why I know a lot of them, like, comparatively to yeah. how many there are, are actually good. Yeah, because, like why regular bead drill? Because Dustox is a threat at, like, level 10 when yeah. you get it. But <laughs> and like level twenty, it's fucking it's like, you know, it's pussy weed, <laughs> whatever that means. <laughs> it's pussy yeah. weed. Probably like N U and P U are just full of bugs. Yeah, N U and P U is like bug world. Um. Anyway, so they need to take into account the Pokemon stats and its move pool, mm-hmm. and its location in the game and its ability. Like and like, they need to take all that into account when they give it its stats. I think, and sometimes they don't. Certainly yeah. they haven't in the past, and, like, Ariados has 40 speed. Yeah, like, why? Spiders are not, last time I checked, Spiders ridiculously slow. slow. Like, yeah. Oh, my God. Like, Armaldo is faster than Ariados. That's ridiculous. Like, <laughs> like, they just need to sit down and be like, look, should this Pokemon really be faster than this other Pokemon? <laughs> really, why did we give Delphox 104 speed? Just to fuck with yeah. it? Just to fuck with mm-hmm. it? Because 105 t- is, like, a really nice speed tier, and yeah. Delphox gets to be slower than everything in that speed tier. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Bear Tick has 10 higher base speed than Aerie does. And Swift Swim. Like ha- Behem is has also has 40 base speed. <laughs> Behem should be even slower than that. Like, yeah. That's, that's the thing. Behem. That's its whole thing is being slow. Yeah. And teleporting around like a motherfucker. Okay. Analytic. VGC. <laughs> I did not see. That's my shit. VGC. That's my... That's oh, my, uh, VGC. My, my thing is Behem and VGC. <laughs> yeah, is it it's, it's and much Riperier, better than VGC. Think, is my team. Yeah, Behem and Riperier, yeah. Goes high am. <laughs> anyway, mm. what we want, what I want to see is is the most. The, I want certain things to get. The thing that I really want more than anything else is for them to get rid of Illuminate. Yes. <laughs> I've been saying this for a long time. Illuminate is yes. stupid. They did this with Stench. Stench was an ability before mm-hmm. it is what it is now, which I'm sure no one even knows about because the only things that get it are fucking Garbodor and Mug. And, so, uh, Skuntank. and Skuntank, which is the only thing I guess anyone would have seen it on. <laughs> it's also pretty slow, so it can't abuse it. Yeah. First of all, give something the ability to abuse Stench. Because yeah. it's Stench. <laughs> and then... <laughs> like, that's the precedent. Stench mm. was the, the opposite of Illuminate. It just made it so you didn't run into Pokemon as often. Yeah. Now it does that and something else and so like either get rid of illuminate altogether or give it some kind of bonus preferably not like a bright powder yeah. built in bright uh, powder because then like be. people will run bright powder like star me and it'll be stupid as yeah. fuck and it will probably <laughs> get banned or something yeah it'll probably end up getting that ability will just get banned which is just stupid so i think it should be get just put it as an item you know if people if people want to not run into pokemon as often make it i mean or maybe they want to run into Pokemon more often. They have the cleanse tag. Yeah. Just make something like the cleanse tag that equates to running into Pokemon more often. Boom, Shekalaka, you're done. You're done. You're done. Like, it's not like that takes it out of the game or anything at all. And maybe they can even give that to you at the beginning so that you can find more Pokemon yeah. easily, easier. Yeah, nice. Anyway, <laughs> I digress. And it can even make you be able to find rarer Pokemon, which would actually make it cool. That would even be cool enough, pretty much, just to run, to not even make any changes to it. Anyway, and I'm saying, give Starmie... I've always been saying this. I even yeah. have a wink next to it in my notes. <laughs> give Starmie Protean. <laughs> oh, my God, yeah. So it can get banned instantly. No, it seriously, it would get banned instantly. <laughs> oh, it, has, yeah, it has such an amazing move pool that yeah. it would just get and banned. And speed right? and special attack. Like. Yeah, but it only has 100 base special attack, which is something that people totally neglect. It's only one... I don't understand why it's so high up in the tiers. I really don't. Maybe I'm using it wrong. It's just rapid spin. It's rapid spin. Yeah. Like, and recover. And yeah. Do people run recover on it? Yeah, like people run like bulky rapid spin, recover, scald. Damn. I need yeah. to try that. Because um, it doesn't have bad defensive stats. Even yeah, no. It's like 88 or something. That's probably wrong, but... <laughs> yeah, slap a life orb on that thing. Protein, like... Yeah. Like, stab life orb. It's like... 
I think it's what made Greninja. Yeah, really good. yeah it's what broke Greninja. Well, I don't think Greninja even broke, and I think it would be perfect in this. And it's also 85-85 defense. Just, I was better Which than is, I thought. Yeah, because <laughs> yeah, Greninja's special attack's only 103. And Starmie can't be as... Okay, the other thing is Greninja had decent attack and special attack, yeah. and Starmie does not have... Yeah, it has 75 base attack. It can't run a physical coverage. move. No. Yeah, they can't... And I don't even think it has the physical... Attacks to even mm. run. Like I'm looking at it now, and I don't. I see double edge. <laughs> <laughs> I see literally nothing physical. Avalanche. Gyro ball. Like gyro ball dive natural gift. Starmie for the win. Pertain. <laughs> no, Pertain wouldn't break Starmie. I don't think it would break Starmie because no. because Greninja's thing was that it could just be like, oh, I'm a special attacker. Now I'm using gunk shot. Like. Yeah. <laughs> was a great yeah. Now too. I'm using all this. Now I'm using acrobatics. <laughs> hey. Mm. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's like fun Greninja. Funky Grand for life. I was, it'll it'll be back. I know it will someday. It's mm -hmm. coming back. We should do, like find like a nice X Y over you. Yeah. Nice and we can play with it. We just need to find yeah that other server mm -hmm. or whatever. Yeah. Um. Anyway, let's talk about some more other stuff. Oh right, Illuminate. Um, yeah, also gets given to Illumis and uh, Volbeat as Volbeat well as Lantern, which should all get regenerated. Lantern, which because like imagine a Baton Pass regenerate Pokemon. Oh. There's nothing like that, and yeah, Volbeat amazing. would have that niche where it's like combo. Tail Glow, Baton yeah. Pass, and Heal. And it, it would be would, awesome. Yeah, it would make even like just Baton Pass like much better. Yeah. Like it's like it. I've seen people use it just as like a way to like kind of get initiative. You can get out of trapping which too. Is, it's like it's like a worse version of Volt Switch in your turn. Yeah. But with Regenerator, that would make it like a little better. It would be really cool, actually. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't even think about that until I just said it. I just yeah. thought they should and get like, Regenerator. Uh, Lantern, Lantern with Volt Switch Regenerator would be really cool. Yeah, it would. It would be really cool. There's not a lot of things with um like like Elomomola has U-turn and Regenerator, and so does like Tornadus T. Yeah. But like yeah, yeah, yeah. that's it. And like, I don't even know when Lomomola got your turn that's weird. I think it gets your turn, doesn't it? I swear. Yeah. I'm gonna look that. Anyway, I probably uh, should do it eliminate. Also, yeah. give Mantine Roost, oh. give Empoleon Roost. Yeah. And oh, give Empoleon would be. Start handing out coil brutal. to things like Scallopede so he can break Scallopede <laughs> instantly. And then Steelix and as well. Steelix, which would be. Because no, oh. give Steelix a reason to run Iron Tail. Just do it. <laughs> yeah. People will do it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's still weak specially, and it's unless you rest it and mm -hmm. run it Mag Special Defense, in which case it can like take five fucking hidden power fires from a Magaton. It's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. And then it just it already has good defense, so like, no need for it. Other things. Oh, it doesn't get U turn. I'm a liar. I'm a liar. Yeah, I'm all liar. Liar. It does not get U turn. I wish. It just seems like it could. <laughs> Give Quillfish an evolution so you can run EV like fucking Quillfish and be the Whoa. most troll person in the universe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was just like thinking about that actually, like making Mega Mawile just an evolution so you yeah. can run EVLA like Mawile. Maybe we make it so that people can eventually absorb their Mega Stones and just stay <sighs> Mega to forever yeah. and then be able to hold items. <laughs> oh, break. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, like an. Oh, I thought about this the other choice day. Choice banded. What Mega if in Mawile. Gen 7? What if in Gen 7 they. Introduce like another dimension where Pokemon. This is where this is my theory on like where Mega Evolution comes from. Mm -hmm. It's another dimension where these stones eventually fall out of that are like where everything is Mega Evolved that can't. Like everything has reached its full potential. Uh, like everything is like there's a ton of energy in this world. So mm -hmm. like everything yeah, is like they like can feed off energy. Like yeah. I mean, all of the Pokemon. I, I definitely uh, Pokemon definitely feed off energy. So mm -hmm. like. Every Charizard is a Charizard X or Y, you know, mm -hmm. that's how they distinguish gender. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> 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 but um, all the Pokemon, and there's more legendaries, like more, a lot, like there's Rayquazas are like a family, you know what I mean? Like there's like the Rayquaza family and their Mega Evolved Grandpa. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. But like, that would be really cool because it would be like a challenging area where if you went in, you're yeah. encountering wild, wild mega, mega evolutions. Yeah, that'd like, be that would be really powerful and you couldn't catch them in this world or whatever because mm -hmm. what use is a Pokeball in this world, you know? But like, yeah. it would be sick. It would be sick. Yeah, that would be really cool. I think that would be a cool concept and be more. Give, give Flygon a Mega already. Some yeah. Bitches. Yeah, either that or Dragon Dance. Yeah. Dragon, dragon Dance would, would be super much cool. It needs a like way to boost its stats. Just one Dragon Dance. And yeah. It would be like a huge threat. I was thinking that, that one way to simply improve a lot of Pokemon is to give them ways to boost their stats because a lot of Pokemon like Jinx actually has nasty plot. Yeah, Jinx has nasty plot. Um, I don't know. I don't have examples <laughs> off the top of my head, but... Um, let me just glance. At, like, give Electivire. There's a lot of Pokemon. Electivire, could, Swords Dance. Yeah. Electivire or Agility. Would, would love either of those. Seriously, yeah. would love either Swords Dance or Agility. Mm -hmm. 
um, like, um, Kirkorok. <laughs> but actually, wait, no, wait, did that thing get Swords Dance? I think so. Uh, no. I, you would have seen the Swords Dance Crocodile. I feel like I have. No, maybe I'm crazy. Um, no, dude, I'm looking at, like, Walrein, for example. I think maybe if you gave Walrein some way to boost its stats. Mm -hmm. Like, it has so, such solid stats. But its move pool is pathetic. I don't know. Just like look at look at those weaknesses that make a Pokemon useless. Hmm. And like what about agility explode? Holy shit, don't <laughs> even say that out loud. Boomburst <laughs> Boomburst <laughs> Porygon Z. Boomburst to Porygon Z with adaptability. Yeah, adaptability boomers. Oh my Z. god. Poly Polygon Z. Polygon Z, everything. Would Just fix Polyrath. That's all I really yeah, want. Yeah, Polyrath. Rapidash too. Give it a little more. Like it's supposed to be the fastest Pokemon ever. Yeah, but it's fucking 105. 105 is pathetic. Like yeah, it beats Delphox, but like, so does everything else. It's 105. Oh yeah, yeah so does my fat dog. But we'll talk about that later. Uh, yeah, give Polyrath. Why is recovery. recovery 112? Perugly is faster than Rapidash. Perugly. Hashtag. Hashtag just get rid of Perugly. Rapid hashtag. Ha hashtag just get rid of Perugly. You just get rid of it. No, I like Perugly. Yeah, it's fun. I like all the cats. I made a cat team and then I made rating <laughs> sank. <laughs> there's actually a surprising variety of types among the cats. There's, yeah, there's Miastic, a lot of cats. And there's like Lifeheart. I'd and consider like Raikou a cat. Really? I, I mean, I was using like Pyroar and Luxray. Yeah, definitely like lower tier kind of Pyroar, stuff. Pyroar, Luxray. Like you don't want to run like an OU, an OU cat team. <laughs> Fusion Evolutions. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Fusion Evolutions. That would be incredible. Like that Octillery. Um, almost start. Actually, almost shell. start. Fusion combo. Luxury yeah. Pyro Ultimate Fusion. Electric fire type. Like the mains just like flowing oh electricity and fire. Yeah. That'd be crazy. Yeah, just an electric fire type in down. general would be really cool. Um, I want, yeah, type, type, new type combinations. Yeah. That would also be cool. Fire. Like if you're going to do something, do something unique. Yeah, I think the coolest typing I, I want to see, like just like the ones that I want to see combined with stuff. Yeah. Like fire, electric, poison, ice. Yeah. I want to see like all those rock. with like crazy, crazy stuff. I like rock mixed rock. with stuff, although there's yeah. a lot of rock type Pokemon. Just because of the fossils. Yeah. yeah. The fossils <laughs> are like the only reason why there's a lot of rock types. And also, I guess there should be pretty common, right? If it's real life. Yeah, rocks are pretty common. <laughs> <laughs> When was the last time you stuck outside without seeing a rock? I dare mm -hmm. you. No, but <laughs> um, and just like take maybe like take one weakness away from rock types. Yeah, maybe be like, hey, you're not actually like we don't actually doesn't really make any sense. Fighting being super effective against steel, steel and rock, and rock really rock. Yeah. I get like I understand. Like, I, I guess just like like super powerful karate masters just can, just like, make break rocks, make but, like, brick break super effective against rock types. Yeah, and kind of like the freeze rock dry smash. Out of super, it. Yeah, the freeze dry mm -hmm. of, of and rock smash. Yeah, yeah, and like you know give that uh, bonus to some some attacks. Maybe mm -hmm. maybe more contextual attacks like that. Yeah, like where. Like sound moves that should work on ghosts, you know. Yeah. Like, these are just simple little things. Mm -hmm. Oh, I want to see thematic thematic gyms instead of type based oh, gyms because type based yes. gyms has been had. Mm -hmm. And like, while it is cool, it's definitely cool. Yeah. Definitely. How many times have you just gotten one Pokemon that countered a guy's team and steamrolled the crap out of him? Yeah. Oh, you know that your your name is. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, your yeah. name is Price. You only use Ice types, so here's one Fire type, and I want and like. Yeah. <laughs> Your name is Price. Yeah, like what I was just thinking, like what about like a caved theme gym where you have like a crowbat and like a Rhyperior. Yeah, the or like, and like and like, like, a, so, like an Onyx or something yeah, too. Like, or like a, maybe like a Dragonair. Yeah, some some like really unique. Yeah, like things that you could find in a cave. Mm -hmm. I don't know what else. Um, like a Ursaring. Yeah, be cool. Ursaring would be cool, like a bear cave. <laughs> yeah, it's awesome. Uh, yeah, the magic yeah, gyms could be cool. Stuff. You could do stuff like for like cave, forest, like yeah, swamp, swamp themed swamp would gym cool. would be awesome. Like like Seismitoad like and like Ludicolo. Crasher Wake returns as the swamp <laughs> type gym leader. Yeah. <laughs> Floatzel. <laughs> Hashtag yes. shout, out. Shout, out. shout out to Floatzel. Yeah, shout out to Floatzel. What does that mean? <laughs> shout out to the Pokemon Floatzel that's our, for being a great Pokemon. Our moveset Monday video has got our most viewed video. Most views. It's at 964 right Watch now. Watch it if you haven't, because it's great. Yeah. It's a great set. I've been but using it, it recently. It throws people off so hard. No one knows what water yeah, bill no is. No one knows. No, I've, I've seen, seen people, <laughs> people, people like triple Will-O-Wisp me, and they're like, <laughs> why does it keep missing? <laughs> yeah. 
It's like, no, fool, I, it says I immune. I see people that, that, like, miss the first one, and they're like, oh, man, I they missed. They see now me I trick go the flame again. orb. Then they will us me, and then they will us me again. Oh, yeah, they miss, and then they're like, and oh. They're just like, oh, man, well, now I've got to try again, because yeah. I just missed, and then it's immune. And like, wait, what? Oh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Didn't two, matter that I missed. Two turns on that fucker. Yeah. I love that. I love mm-hmm. that it doesn't tell you that it's immune if it misses. <laughs> Yeah, like, you can still miss if it's a... Like, if it go, yeah. if, like, you hit, like, you go for a normal type move on a ghost Pokemon, like, if it has a chance yeah, to miss, every time it's just gonna say it's immune. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And, like, if you hit, like, go for, like, I an electric-type move or, like, a ground-type move or, or something... Take down. I was trying to think of take normal-type down. moves that actually had a chance yeah. to miss, because yeah. there aren't a lot of them. They're I was just kind of s- going off the top Crush of my head. Crush Sorry. Mm-hmm. <laughs> take um, down. <laughs> But let's talk about Polyrath. Oh, yeah, Polyrath. We, so we only briefly mentioned it. Please, Drain Punch, yeah, drain Mach punch, punch, maybe Aqua Jet, any of these things. Jet. And, like, does it get Swords Any Dance? one of these things, no yeah, Swords Dance. Any one of these things would make it much better. No Swords Dance, there's no that. Uh, bulk Up is a cool idea on it, it really is, because it has decent special mm-hmm. defense. It could be a cool Bulk Up Pokemon if it, like, had priority options. Other than Vacuum Wave. <laughs> I mean, why did you give it Vacuum Wave? Yeah. <laughs> why not I guess that was you trying punch. to slip something there, like, oh, just use the work up Hydro Pump Vacuum Wave set. And you're like, yeah, I'll try that, and it'll give me zero kills. <laughs> I'll go back and forth between Ice Beam and Mud Shot. Yeah. That's the last one. <laughs> I have some people run uh, Specs. I get Psychic. <laughs> yeah, like Psychic Hydro Pump Vacuum Wave Specs set. Okay. Okay, like, alright, but... Like, it doesn't why? have a great special attack stat, so... Yeah, it's, like, it's only, like, 80, maybe, tops. Mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure it's less than that. Look at it. Oh, my God, Poly- I just love it's looking 70. at Polyrath. Polyrath is just so... Like, so they gave cool. Politoed anything it could ever want yeah, in the form of Drizzle. Like, either just, yeah. why don't you just give that Drizzle? Huh? Yeah. Hmm? Then it, it would miss out Swift Swim, but... Who needs Swift Swim when you can just Drizzle, drizzle Waterfall people in the face, and then yeah. maybe give it Aqua Jet? And you know what? Just give it like ten more attack. Yeah, do a stat <laughs> overhaul. Yeah, stat overhaul is the main theme in this <laughs> yeah. like discussion. Do a stat overhaul. Do a stat overhaul. Uh, but then I guess just so we don't run out of time, mm-hmm. let's move on to our fat dogs. Okay. Uh, I'll go first with one of mine. Uh, I think we're sticking to lower tiers, right? Yeah. Uh, one that I used, I've used. It was my la- the last time I used just one battle. I mean, yeah. Uh, I used rock polish right here. Yeah. And it was, <laughs> it was a life orb. Oh, a life, life orb. Oh, damn. <laughs> and brutal. it, like, I literally, like, I would just go to team preview and I'd just be like, that dies to right here, that dies to right Yeah, here. everything dies to right here. Yeah, and I was just like, oh my god, this is really good. And I just had so much fun with it. So, if you get stealth axe up too, it can just yeah, sweep. Like, yeah, I ran it with, like, a quillfish lead. Yeah. And just, like, set up a few spikes and, like, it's over. Quillfish, Quillfish Rapierio is a really strong combo because yeah. it, it resists, it, it can take grass type physical attacks mm-hmm. decently well with Quillfish, mm-hmm. especially with yeah, Intimidate. Yeah, it's neutral. And Intimidate. Yeah. Uh, and then Water type as well, so you can cover both of those kind of, except yeah. not Gastrodon <laughs> <laughs> or Seismitoad. Yeah. <laughs> well, anyway, Rock Polish Rapierio, use it or lose to it. Use it or lose to it. <laughs> Alright, well, we'll, we'll, we'll alternate. We wanted yeah, to do so a double, yeah. double yeah, fat dog. Because it's been so long since we fat dog. Well, what, what moves would you throw on that? Uh, I usually go Stone Edge. Earthquake. Well, Rock Polish, obviously. Earthquake. Uh, I would do Rock Blast. Rock Blast seems to which be your go to like, on that. Kind of cool. Where Stone Edge is also really good. Mm-hmm. And then the last move. What did I do? Megahorn? Yeah, I did. <laughs> I never used it, but I had I it. I love Megahorn. Although, it, you know what? Megahorn hits on the Switch, which is which is tough for Rapier to hit, is Rotom Leaf Blower. Yeah. Rotom Leaf Blower, yeah. <laughs> Rotom Leaf Stormer. That's true, yeah. It, it is kind of a threat. Mm-hmm. And it also hits this guy. Yeah. Shift, shift tree. tree. Yeah. But uh, um, what are you doing staying in a shift tree without <laughs> your assault vest or yeah. whatever? Yeah. Um, or max yeah. defense. Because Rotom also doesn't hurt get hurt by spikes either, so. Also, it can totally take a shade bomb at full health. Oh, yeah, probably. Because she. Solid rock, not seed rock. Yeah. Solid okay. rock is good. What was my FUPA? Um, uh, I forget. Okay, my fattest of dogs for this week. <laughs> okay, what I've been actually having a ton of fun running is Miss Magius. I've been running oh, it a yeah. lot. It, I don't know what happened. I don't know why it fell down into NU. Honestly, it's, it's, it's really just strong. It's been in NU, I think. Like no, it was in it was, it was in RU at some point. I know it was because the nasty pot set was fairly common, yeah. and that's what I've been running lately. I yeah, ran. There's actually two sets. There's a great lead set that I've been running. Um, the Destiny Bond, Willowisp Taunt, and Shadow Ball. Seriously, 
It's fantastic. I mean, you could run yeah, hex. Yeah. You could run hex instead. Mm -hmm. I do. You do end up statusing most things. Yeah. But at the same time, like. Hex isn't like I, hex is good because the idea is to like taunt block the stealth rocks or whatever because mm -hmm. I think you're gonna attack uh, will yeah. them or take an attack or you know yeah. maybe shadow ball them once take another mm -hmm. attack and then destiny bond them to take yeah. them down like the idea is you want it to stay out until it takes something out mm -hmm. and it, and it works damn well it can cripple <laughs> like two or three things while they're trying to avoid destiny bond um pair it with sticky web for best best effect. Oh yeah, no, but, sticky um, web is underrated. Sticky web OP. That's my that's my <laughs> second fat dog. But um, nasty pot set though is also really strong with <laughs> nasty pot. Of course, shadow ball. Then you, I run thunderball and psychic. Uh, thunderball and psychic are literally exclusively for Aloma Mungus. Um, <laughs> I, I just hate Aloma yeah, Mungus Aloma so Mungus much that just psychic just is to kill uh, is Mungus and thunderball is for Aloma Mola, and it works every time. They both yeah. always die to it pretty much. Um, one thing psychic does not kill hit on top. In one hit, uh, yeah, does not kill have good special defense. the hitmons. Hitmon in <laughs> one hit, so uh, definitely fat dog for the week though. Definitely, uh, I'll do my next one, which is Sigilith, offensive. Oh yeah, that set. thing's been actually taken over. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's that actually now. been a lot more common. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I'm so I glad that I haven't seen well. the other one in <laughs> so long. I'm so happy about it. Yeah. And yeah, like Life Orb is just good. Hey, actually, Rex. <laughs> yeah, I did put Calm Mind on one once, and it yeah. was really cool. Calm Mind with Life Orb, yeah, Calm is Mind brutal. Life, yeah, it just like shreks people. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you get one up, it's like yeah. they're like, oh no, he's gonna do Calm Mind setup forever. But then you just murder them on the next turn. Murder them on the next turn. Yeah, it's 103 special attack with the Life Orb. Magic Guard is already really good. Yeah, and then um, and 97 mind, base speed is a great tier because yeah. you outspeed all that crappy things that are 95 base, mm -hmm. which is like a pretty pretty significant base speed yeah. to hit. Especially in RU, it's like mm. really great. Like There's lots of slow stuff in RU. Drapion also. I don't know. You yeah. outspeed Drapion for those clutch kills when you ice beam it. It has yeah. amazing coverage. Ice beam, heat wave. Yeah, it gets so good. Just don't run Psyshock. I like Psyshock. <laughs> I don't know what it is about Psyshock. It doesn't kill when you need it to. Yeah, and Psychic yeah. does. And <laughs> Psychic just puts holes in the team. It really does. It's like yeah, your power move. Yeah. Air and Slash uh, is also great for goal. switches. Yeah, not switches. Yeah, not switches. Air Slash is great for that. Like, <laughs> well, what am I going to do? Do I do Air Slash or do I do, you know, s something else? <laughs> air Slash can flinch. Yeah. <laughs> it also gets Energy Ball for that grass coverage. It's always good to have on your team. Oh, I'm, what I'm saying is if you know you can 2 kill with Psychic, why not Air Slash first and then Psychic so the potential chance potential of you chance to flinch. flinching them. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's what's basically good about Air Slash is the chance to flinch. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, but why don't we move on to our, our next final dog? Our final, final fat dog. <laughs> okay, the final fat dog of the evening is gonna be Levani. Actually, mm. Levani's really problem I, is my favorite yeah. s sticky web setter. Yeah. Um, because every ground water type is afraid of it, even though you don't even run a grass move. <laughs> yeah. No, the way I like to run it is focus stash mm -hmm. with swarm as its ability. So um, you can get those nice. Yeah, because you're gonna if you're running a focus dash, you're probably expecting to go down to focus dash pretty often. <laughs> and you can get those high powered X scissors out. Mm -hmm. um, stick you up with swords dance. Oh, that's crazy to get swords. Dance. Um, baton pass and X scissor. So the idea is y you just do whatever you can with it. Yeah. it usually it dies, but y sometimes you can get off a of baton pass swords dance to something like Flygon or I run it with Floatzel, that weird Floatzel, mm -hmm. and like it. It might not stay in, like I might not keep it in for that, but yeah. like it can threaten. Also, what I really like doing is going out to Golbat with it and having a plus two Golbat <laughs> that's bird. sitting there with Brave Bird and uh, and it's you know just waiting in the wing, so to speak. Yeah, get it. So it's still just as bulky as ever, but it has this just smashing the hell out of you with yeah, with a super powerful Brave Bird. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm, like, it's making me want to run just like a swords dancing. Mm -hmm. Levani, which is like a leaf blade X scissor. Yeah, no, and it gets knockoff in. That's what I was going to say. It got knockoff in this generation. Oh. Finally, it had a cover. It didn't have a coverage move before, and that mm -hmm. was really the yeah, problem with does. with Swords Dance Levani. Yeah. Because it's, it's like, it's fucking good. It has 92 yeah. speed, which is kind of lame. It's kind of, a, it's just <laughs> under the speed tier. 311 is what it maxes out at. And only 103 attack, which is like, but 103 <laughs> attack. With Swords Dance. With, 80, with 75, 80, 80 defenses is, means you're going to get mm -hmm. up to Swords Dance. Yeah. Unless you're against a fire or flying type. Yeah. But that's why you have focus dash. Yeah, that's why you have focus dash. You get your sword sense up and then you crush them with 
knockoffs Leaf Blade or Leaf Blade strong move. Yeah, Leaf Blade is X's great. Are, that's some strong. And everything. if you're at Swarm with Swords Dance, Axes are will be putting in a lot of work. Yeah. yeah. Definitely, definitely. It'll be doing huge damage. Like I don't run my physical attack, and yet I it can um I think at max physical attack it can actually kill. Um, oh, I do run it with max attack. That's weird. I should yeah. run it with max bulk or something. Anyway. <laughs> It yeah. is oh it is enough to like do seventy five percent to sigil if and some other things that are like neutral take neutral damage from bug attacks. Mm -hmm. It's pretty fucking strong. Mantine awesome. goes down to seventy five percent off of Swords Dance Exeter, which is mm -hmm. actually pretty cool. But then yeah. Air Slash is gonna kill you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna play some NU, I think. Yeah. Yeah, and yeah. seems like it's a lot of fun actually. Yeah, you try it. <laughs> Maybe in the next round of just one battle. I'll do mm -hmm. an NU. Maybe. Or maybe we'll just do a live. Maybe we'll, we'll see. Like, see what I'm feeling. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. Anyway, I think that'll wrap it up because we are running out of time and we did get over everything we want to talk about. So, guys, yeah, show us some love for a great big podcast. Finally, back to we're the back to uh, show you we love you still. <laughs> yeah, uh, tell us your fat dog down yeah. in the description. Uh -huh. Not the description. I mean the comments section. <laughs> we'll tell you. Yeah. No. Don't uh, tell us. We'll tell you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Don't tell us. Don't. Please listen to us. Um, uh, hit that like button. Vote Bernie. Uh, vote, Bernie. <laughs> vote Bernie and uh, uh, listen to DJ Gallade. Listen to DJ Gallade only. And Romeo. Shout out to Glitch again for the yes. fact that we always use your music. Because your music is awesome. <laughs> it'll it'll definitely be in this video, even yeah. though we don't hear it right now. It'll be in this video. Five real. Um, Shouts to Space God for being space yep. and also exactly. time. <laughs> Dialga and Palky. Oh what? Dialga. Dude, I, I was thinking about like what who would win in a fight between like IRL Kyogre and IRL like Dialga. Like, like, well, like they wouldn't fight normally, but no. what would happen if they fought? Oh uh, well, it does. Uh, type advantage goes to Dialga definitely. Kind of, but uh, water is a steel. Yeah. So. And uh, so he, Kyogre has uh, Ice Beam and Thunder, mm -hmm. stuff like that he can use. Plus those Hydro Pumps. Yeah, I'd, 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 I'd pay to see it. I'd pay to see it. I'd pay to see it. <laughs> pay to see it. I, you heard me first, Nintendo. <laughs> pay to see it. Now, I appreciate that's actually part of the Hoopa thing, is the idea that they bring together a bunch of legendaries and all the legendaries yeah. are fighting. That's like a whole like, portal thing. And then Zygarde's like, what the fuck are you fucking doing, bro? <laughs> thousand arrows and just kills everyone. Yep. A thousand arrows is going to be epic. Oh, yeah. I can't wait. More ground that. moves that hit. Oh, times. yes. <laughs> and electric, so electric, bone meringue, give bone meringue that property. Yeah, like stuff like that. Yeah, be, what would even do? That doesn't make sense. Or like sense. a poison move that hits acid, acid. like acid, acid yeah, spray. Exactly should both be super effective against steel mm -hmm. types. Context-based moves. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Anyway, we're rambling now. Ramble on. Uh, leave comments down below. What's your fat dog, and what do you want us to talk about like next episode? Us, of the podcast? please, because we love yeah. your likes and yeah. we like your love. If you haven't subscribed already, make sure to do that because there's so much Pokemon content on there this channel. There is a ton of Pokemon yeah. content already. We have yeah. like 200 we have videos. over 200 yeah. videos now. Yeah. And it's awesome. Yeah, it's beautiful. So we have a lot of content. Join the dreamers. Dream on. Dream, dream on. on. <laughs> and yeah, so guys, dream on. We'll see you next time. <laughs> Peace out. <laughs> We're getting ready to keep dreaming or what? <laughs> keep dreaming.